Bear we are heading to the grocery store in a second. So we're gonna sit here for a little bit and talk to y'all while the car warms up. I woke up with the intention this morning of going to the grocery store and y'all know how I always have really bad anxiety. So I didn't actually go to sleep until 4.30 this morning because I had anxiety really bad because I knew I was gonna go to the grocery store today. And then Fairby woke me up at eight, which I really tried to lay in bed because I just was not ready to get up. But um, I ended up getting up about 8.20, maybe 8.30 or so and just getting ready for the day and, and going. Um, and Fairby knew we were going to the grocery store and so she puts it into sport mode basically <laughs> whenever she knows we're gonna go do something fun. Um, so I told her whenever we came out this morning because obviously it's super important that she does all of her different potty businesses in the morning if we're gonna go somewhere um, or right before we go somewhere, right? So whenever we were outside, I was like, we're gonna go to the grocery store, you know, if you can go. And she literally started like running in circles and like so excited and then of course she went. Basically, she just loves to go, she loves it. She has a sweatshirt on underneath her vest and then we're gonna do the crossbody again like we've been doing. Since that incident happened with that woman coming up to us and basically, accusing me of stealing Faraby. I have wanted her leash on the shortest, closest one it can be to me, which before I used to like for her to have a lot of slack. Um, not like a lot like irresponsible, but you know, like maybe like two feet of slack, right? So she can wiggle where she needs to wiggle and stuff. Oh, for some of you who've asked if they can lay down in a, uh, in the sleepy pods, yeah. So this is how it goes. So you see, if this were to lock in place, then this would actually pull her backwards like that. Um, or it would tighten. I don't know if it would pull her because, you know, it's like not going to actually go into action like pull you. But it would stop her in this motion, which would still have her back be like towards the seat. So I'm not sure if that answers questions about that. If anyone had any. But anyway, she's trying to make <laughs> me go. Okay, we're going to go. I decided to do an uncut version of us going to the grocery store. And there's a few parts that I sped up just because Faraby's kind of out of frame and stuff and there's no reason for y'all to sit through that for so long. And then I have had to cut if there was a person like where you could see their face. So those are the only things I've cut, but I thought it might be super fun for y'all just to see an uncut version of what it's really like. So enjoy.
with us today. I hope you enjoyed seeing this mostly uncut shopping trip. We'll see you next week. Bye guys.